Garcia calls himself a city cowboy. I didn't really get to experience the, the kind of the country life until later on in my high school when I moved out to a ranch out in Brazoria County. But his love for the rodeo and his community runs deep. Garcia vividly recalls attending the rodeo's Go Tejano Day as a kid, getting the chance of a lifetime, watching Selena's very last performance at the Houston Astrodome. Even when I watch the movie and they highlight the Astrodome performance uh, during that movie, I can always say I was there. Uh, and that just, so again, not knowing the impact that it was going to have. And so that's why I treasure the shows today, because you just never know about the future and what they're going to mean. After law school, Garcia became a volunteer for the rodeo, eventually joining the Gotejano Committee, where he met his wife. And now he's stepping into his most important role within the organization. He's the first Hispanic member of the executive committee for the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo. I love that committee and everything that it does. Since the committee's inception, more than $9.3 million has been raised for scholarships. Of the many applicants over the years since 2023, 30% of recipients were Hispanic or Latino, a son of immigrants. Garcia knows how vital these scholarships can be. Families who, in giving that scholarship to their kid, have told me they didn't know how they were going to manage putting their child through school. And is as a result of the rodeo, it's impacted them feeling that now they can make it. So when I hear those stories from families, from kids that are going to school as a result of the Houston Livestock Show and Rodeo, it makes me want to do more. And it is on Gotejano Day at the rodeo that the Hispanic community makes an impressive impact every year. In 2023, Los Tigres del Norte broke the second highest paid concert attendance record in rodeo's history with 75,595 people. There are so many things that have happened out here that has impacted my life that wants me to give back even more. Having a seat at the table gives Garcia the opportunity to make sure Houston's Hispanic community continues to be supported and represented.